And on that note, what is going on, fellow farmers? Welcome back to another map tour. Today, we're going to be having a look at a map called PGR uh, sl uh, sl Swilno. Swilno, I think that's how you say it. PGR Swilno. Uh, this is made by Wowick 12. It's a large farm engaged in the cultivation of plants and animal husbandry. The map includes 23 fields, including 5 meadows, 11 points of sale. Six production buildings, sawmill, BGA, three forests, land previously purchased, three villages, extensive railway network. In the new player mode, you get a ready farm with machines. Uh, so big shout out to Walwick 12 for this map for PGR. Let's go ahead and let's hop up here real quick, ladies and gentlemen. Let's have a look around. Let me speed my guy up just a little bit. So that's a very nice map, guys. It's uh, very flat, very long, very, very nice, very nice. Let's go ahead and hop back down and let's hop into and the store here and see what we own by default so looks like we got quite a bit of equipment uh we own a small tractor here a fendant a fent sorry we own in medium tractors we own a fent we own a vulture and a john deere for harvesters we own that same old dudes far <laughs> we own a jcb telehandler a 1986 pickup truck we own three trailers one by rudolph two by wilger this is nice now these two guys if you don't know you can connect these trailers together with this one right here. If you hit the combinations right there, you can connect to that trailer. And this one's same as well. Sorry about that, guys. Just got done drinking some NOS. Uh, you can also connect that to that trailer. Uh, so, just a little food for thought. The header, we got a deuce far header. We've also got an aggro plow. We've got an aggro mass uh, disc harrow right here. Got a coon power harrow. We've got a coon cedar. We've got a coon beller. We've got a quickie front loader. And here's our front loader tools made by Albert there, Universal Bucket. And uh, over here, we got our telehandler tools, which is a Universal Bucket. This bucket is awesome. It's like one of the biggest buckets in the game. We also have a pallet fork. We have a header trailer. We have a weight made by Tim Winkle, the Pack 1000. And something I haven't seen on the forums before, we have the belt systems included. So pretty cool stuff. Uh, let's go ahead and hop into the map here, guys, and see what we own by default. This is a very big map. So by default, oh, we own quite a bit of land. Look at this. We own a lot of the water source. Uh, by default, let me so zoom out here. By default, we own field 19. We own field 13. We own the main part of the farm and a little bit of this grassland right over here. And I think that's pretty much it. But as you guys can see, we own a lot of the map. Uh, I, think, <clears throat> I think the only thing we probably don't own is some of the other land. But other than that, guys, there's a lot of stuff here that we do own. Uh, let's have a look at the points here. We're going to start right here. We got a bakery. We got a biomass heating plant. There's our vehicle shop, gas station right there, uh, our farmhouse, a cow barn, in which we'll take a tour around the main part of the farm. There's the rent train spot right there. There's our our large cow barn. We have a pig sty. Got a garden center over here. Up in this corner, we have the animal dealer. Let's zoom out. And then over here, guys, we've also got a place where you can rent the train, a uh, debris crusher, lime station. Uh, railroad silo north where you can sell your stuff your crop on the train right there uh, This is also a rent train area cooperative right there dairy Over here. We have a lime station a sugar mill and another uh, Train there. So that's those are where you rent your trains at. I believe guys uh, Let's go down to the bottom of the map here. Let's scroll over over here another spot to rent your train the grain mill uh, GCHB Grain Elevator, which is the big building for your cell point. Um, this right here is going to be your sawmill, carpentry, another vehicle shop here, a spinnery for your wool, uh, electric charging station. So that's pretty cool. I did not see no electric tractors, but there's a charging station on the map. So that's that's pretty cool. That's different. Haven't seen that before. A bio, uh, bio, biomethane station if i can spit it out uh this is for your uh biomethane uh refill purposes right there uh that is pretty much it for that part so let's head over to let's head over to the main part of the map if it will let me visit one of these spots okay here we go so let's take a tour around the main part of the farm here in which that's what this is going to be so this is going to be our pickup right here ladies and gentlemen there's our pickup truck. Uh, that's, of course, is going to be, is this our sleep trigger or a selling point? Okay, that's your sleep trigger. Um, over here is some of our equipment right here. There's our trailers. We've got a lot of equipment on this farm, guys. I like that. I really, really like that. 
Uh, this is why I have such a hard time picking maps sometimes to play on because there's so many maps to choose from. Uh, and the game has not even been out for a year yet. And we've already got all these maps to choose from. So uh, there's some equipment over there, guys. you got a lot of storage here, room for more equipment if you decide to buy some. Um, heading over this way, I'm assuming these open. And they do. Nice little shed right here. Very nice. Uh, this is your vehicle workshop right here, ladies and gentlemen, I believe. That it is. Let's go ahead and does this door not open? Okay, there we go. And do we have lights? Lights? Lights anywhere? We have lights? There's got to be a light switch somewhere. Come on. Where's the... There's a sink right there. Let me get my help window pulled up. There's got to be... There's got to be a light switch somewhere. Okay, I do not see a light switch. I mean, I'm sure it's here. I'm just not... I'm just not finding it. Uh, so let's head on out. And let's go over to... Uh, what is this right here? Let me open this. Another big barn right here, guys. Check this out. So lots of room for storage on this map. Uh, let's open this one up. Another big barn here. Look at this, guys. This is actually pretty cool, man. Uh, I have not seen a map like this yet. This is the first one for me that has so much storage room on it. Um, and what is this right here? Okay, this is your biomethane station right here, guys and girls. Where you get your biomethane. Um, and then if we go over to here, this is probably going to be the cow barn. Yep, that's exactly what it is. Let's go ahead and pop up here. This is your cow barn here, guys. Now, what I would do normally, I would probably sell something like that. Sell a majority of these buildings and have a little bit of extra money in new farmer mode. That way I could get a better, better start and get uh, the equipment that I want. So I would sell like probably the cow barn, uh, maybe one of the sheds I'm not using. Uh, over here is going to be our telehandler with our telehandler tools. We got more storage right here. Um, over here is going to be our beller along with our harvester and our header on the trailer right there. Let's go ahead and pop down and open this up. I'm assuming this opens. Another big shed right here, guys and girls. Look at all this storage space, man. It's absolutely amazing. Uh, big shout out again to Wawick 12 uh, for this PGR map. I wish I could say the last word, but I can't. I think it's um, Swil Swilno. I don't know. I have no idea how you say that. Uh, but let's look at the map here and see what we've looked at. Let's go back over towards this way if I can get my guy to move. And I think that is pretty much it, guys and girls. There is your map tour. For PGR, whatever that last word is, big shout out again to Warwick12 for this map, ladies and gentlemen. There's one of your belt systems right there. Is that both of them? That is both of them right there. Subscribe if you're new, ladies and gentlemen. Smash that like button for me. Click that bell and click also never miss any future content or live streams. Till next time, ladies and gentlemen, this is CJ Farms. And one crop at a time, we are helping America grow. I will see you all in the next video.